Right, wait a minute. We're good. You can see ourselves. Yeah. Very clear. Okay, guys. Now, my sister is I am here with Ebony. Hi. Hey, Ebony. Say hi to my people. Hi. <laughs> yeah. So, Ebony, you said you're 23, right? Yes, that's correct. It is your first time in the carnival. This is my first time jumping. Mm -hmm. What made you come? To that conclusion you have to come in and, and um, then participate i don't know i just felt like i was at the right age and it just felt like the right time so i just you know decided to jump okay so your parents you still live with your parents i live with my mom with your mom yeah. so your mom has no objection no she's she's like she's, she's okay with yeah you. she's good so is it a culture i see all the women here they gladly accept to put this this clothing you have to buy it yourself yes or they provide it to you or do you have a group well, that you are no you pay for the package and then they give you the costume so you pay oh, you pay for the package yeah. to come yeah to come mm -hmm. okay and after you finish is there like a price for whoever has the no i wouldn't say that there's no price no no price at all what i thought there was a price no not that i know well not for the individuals i think for the band for the band yeah for the band like for the best band etc but not like an individual jumper like myself okay for yourself and how long this will last until what until what time so the jump will last about three to four hours uh -huh. and then like people usually party after the jump for like another three to four hours after that where the party will be taking place that would be spring garden so that where that's where the jump ends in spring garden so you mean that we start from here yeah. and then the park will be all the way to the spring, spring garden. garden yeah and then when we get there spring garden discard that for me is it like a big it's a it's a highway actually so it'll so be they like... close all the no cars no no cars that highway will be closed and mm. it'll be full of stalls and djs and stuff like that but and then this thing and everything yeah and then right. everybody's going to be up and down mm -hmm. okay wow so this is your first year but prior to that you never came or you used to come well i used to come and just watch from this side of the road but i never passed as a spectator as a spectator yeah that's correct yeah and then this year decided to enjoy yeah this year i decided to participate i wanted to get my hands dirty you know how, how are you going to get your hand dirty by that saying oh, everybody oh, okay dancing so how is the culture here is it true while you are dancing anybody can come behind you yep. and then why yeah that's right you, will you have any problem with that no only like if they have bad hygiene what you mean like if they smell bad you know maybe. smell bad yeah. so you want to tell sweaty. me you want to tell me if you're working and then i come and i start doing my thing behind you that's right do, do i smell nice like you smell very nice so therefore you will let me dance yeah i'll let you dance oh yes <laughs> okay guys so ebony it is a pleasure so i am going to wait for you i'm going to be looking for you i'm going to see you know how to dance of course you know how to win yeah are you good i'm i'm okay you okay i'm okay <laughs> so is it is it a competition whoever on among you girls has the best whining well no i wouldn't say that but like each band has a fly girl so the fly girls at the front of the band uh -huh. and they do their thing so i think the fly girls have their own competitions the fly, the fly girls so each fly girl is leading a band yes that's correct and then you being young in that band you follow you make make the fly girl then that's right can you do your own move freestyle yeah i can or do you have to follow what she's no, doing no i don't have to follow what she's doing she does her own thing and then we do our own thing okay yeah so this is my first time in barbados mm -hmm. What advice do you have for someone like me who just came to this country? Because I am very intrigued. I stay at, at Christ Church. I have not much about Barbados. Since you were born here, have you been outside this country? Yes, I have been. Where? I've been to Panama, I've been to St. Lucia, I've been to London. To London. Mm -hmm. And what made you decide to come back and not say in London or uh, one of those countries you've been? Well, I think like, Barbados for me is a is a bit slower pace. You know, like, London's a really big city. Even Panama has about three million people, so here it's much smaller. And you can just like basically you can live a more free life. Free life. Yeah. yeah. But this is very expensive here. Yeah, it's very expensive here. But I mean, as it anywhere you live, you adapt. You, you adapt. Just, you just adapt to it. So how do you adapt here? Because since you were born here, do you work? You go to school? Yeah, I do work. Um, I would say like the best way to adapt is to have multiple jobs. So mm -hmm. you have like income, you have passive income, you have residual income. There's different types of income coming in. And you should be okay. 
So you do have passive income? Yes, I do have passive income. And what is it as a passive income you do? So for passive, I have a makeup artistry. Uh -huh. So I do that passive. I say passive because it's seasonal, like pop over season and graduation. That's seasonal. Okay. That's where you get, you know, the party season where you get most of the makeup. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Then I also do catering as well. Catering? Yeah. You cook? Yes, I do. Bajan food. Bajan food. Yes. Okay. All right. And then? And what do I do? A makeup, catering. What else do I do? I do? I do like a little bit of portrait and stuff like that too. Okay. Yeah. But those are my two main. My two, two main, two main, two main yes. things. And I do modeling as well. Oh, modeling. Yes, please. Okay. So, what is your aspiration in five years? Where do you see yourself in five years? Um, I actually want to be an event holder. Uh -huh. So, I want to hold events and I also want to own a restaurant. I mean, if you go into that part, I think you are going to accomplish that. Thank you so much. Were you yesterday at that big event? Um, I went there. The the, yeah. yeah, I was there actually. They closed it on us. They closed? So, the Soka 550, five something like that. They're oh, there. no, I didn't go to that one. Oh. Not Soka 5.0. No, 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 no. Not no. that one. It was huge. It was. Yeah, and then by 8 o'clock, 9, and then they shut it down because wow. of the Well, there, there's so many parties, I can't get to all of them, you know. <laughs> oh, Israeli, how long that starts? From what month to what month? So that starts from about July. From June, and then every weekend there's party? Yes, that's correct. Wow. Yeah. And then there are some private parties, some public parties, yeah. things like that. So some weekends have multiple parties. So some weekends have like five parties on five one parties night. On mm -hmm. All right, Ebony. So I'm not going to keep you much because there are other people I'm going to talk to here. So definitely, thing. All right. It's a pleasure. Nice meeting you. Thank you okay, very much. Thank you very much. Too. All right. Okay. So you see, you haven't that shy. No, no, no. Look at you. <laughs> you. Oh, you shouldn't be because you said you were a model.